Hey, hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Jess, welcome back to my channel. You guys saw, you saw the intro pic, right? It is Boxy Ipsy time. So I'm gonna do my makeup using the products in these subscription boxes and let's hope and cross our fingers that everything comes out all dandy. And yes, I have swatches for you guys. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe, click that bell to be notified of future videos so you can join our journey and share because sharing is caring i need you guys to absolutely share please guys let's try to get us to a thousand subscribers maybe by the 21st of february maybe mm, i'm wishing on a star right anyways make sure you smash that like button because it helps your girls channel out and i appreciate it from the bottom of my heart so let's get started because i'm rambling all right so we're going to start with Ipsy, and we're going to run through this quick. Ipsy is a $10 subscription box. You guys know what it is, because don't nobody live under a rock. Well, maybe. I'm rambling. Okay, so it's a $10 subscription. It's monthly. You can um, prepay it, uh, I think, three or six months or even a year. And, of course, you know, uh, you get some type of discount. But you get sample sizes or travel size items um, of all types. It supposedly goes by your profile, but I don't ever get shit that comes that's part of my profile. I get nice stuff, but never anything that I had clicked on, you know, that would follow my profile. But anyway, that's another story. So let's get started. What comes in Ipsy? You get a bag every single month. This month... It's this mesh bag. I don't know why, but what else? You got the stripes, pink, blue, green, of course. You know, spring is coming soon, so hello. It says Ipsy here on the tag. It has this little cute tie. Open it up. You got your bag. Nice lime green colors. I mean, it's adorable bag. First thing here is this. It's Lou or Loué by Jean Sale. It's a balanced, hydrating, and calming serum. Now, my face is clean. I wash my face. I am going to be using all the products in both. The, well, not all of them. Not this one. Um, this is actually, let's go to this one. This is Real Chemistry Fresh Start Foaming Cleanser for a smooth, oh, soft, clean start. It is 0 0.5 fluid ounce. So it's just a foaming cleanser. You cleanse your face with it in the morning and night. It's um, foamy. And, oh my God, it smells fresh. Oh, I like that smell. It really smells like a fresh start. I got this, the what I was talking about. So this is um, a hydrating and calming serum. So this is two, 0 0.5 full ounce. It says this is step two after... You cleanse your face, which I already did, so I'm going to go ahead. And I love using serums. All right, we're going to let that dry and see how that feels. So the next thing in my Ipsy is this City Color Contour Palette. And it's a contour palette. You get highlight, bronzer, and contour. And here are the shades. The next thing in our Ipsy is, I'm not gonna stop saying that because we know this is Ipsy right now, is a Bella Pierre Cosmetics Stay Put Brow Gel. There you go. I got the color uh, Licorice is my shade. And you pop the top out, serum. And you have your brush. It's kind of like the Benefit. These are all so good to travel with. All right, guys, so the next thing in here is this Liquid Lip Lingerie by NYX, and it's in the shade um, Beauty Mark. I have Beauty Mark already, so that's the color right there. Um, it's beautiful. I love it. It's amazing. Again, I'm burning incense. If you guys see this at all in my next few videos, um, I have like an incense burn. It's really cute, so I'm burning incense. Don't get alarmed. So I'm going to put this in a giveaway um, that I'm already building up. So this will be in that giveaway. All right, guys. So that's it. That's the fifth item. Um, we're going to move on to BoxyCharm. But just so you guys know, my face feels 
so soft, smooth. It feels so nice. Like, it feels really, really nice. So, um, I'm excited. I'm going to give this a try, and let's see where this takes us. All right, guys, so now we're going to jump into our boxy charm. So, yes, yes. And I'm going to hang my card right here, right in front of me. And I'm going to follow through with what I wrote. I'm excited. Okay, so now the next thing is our boxy charm. The first thing that I'm pulling out, of course, is the card. And it says, Rock 2018. Rock and roll so. So it gives you all of the items and the prices, which is something Ipsy doesn't do. Um, but I'll leave everything linked down in the description bar. I'm not affiliated or sponsored by anyone. I pay for all this with my money. Um, but I will leave the links. If you want to go ahead and check out Boxy Charm and Ipsy, you're more than welcome to. So now, again, this is the card. It is so pretty. It reminds me of... um. The 80s. Yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. So the first item that I have in here is this Girlactic Matte Lip Paint. The shade is Posh, and I have Posh, and I also have a backup of Posh, so I don't think that it would be cool not to share. Oh my God, and these smell so good, and that's Posh right here. And... So that means that this is going into that giveaway as well. The next item is this Brow Power, the Universal Brow Pencil Crayon by It Cosmetics. That's the packaging. And it's just Universal Taupe is the shade. You get a little booklet with information on how to use it and, you know, how to darken it. If you have darker hairs, if you need um, more intense uh, color then it just tells you how to use it. So here's the pencil. I Love how the handle you see how it's cut like that. It's like that on both sides So let's open this up. You have a spoolie on one end and it's oh my god This is such a nice spoolie you could tell like right off the bat and of course it is that shape that I don't like which is that triangular shape, but Whatever, we're going to go ahead and give it a try. So I'm going to swatch this right here. Okay, so it's not soft, but it's not like a hard pencil. So if I go light, that's your light shade. And this would be me going darker. All right. So the next thing in here is this Pure Bronze and Brighten Compact. I really like this compact. It shows you everything that's in there. It, the name of this compact is Dreamer Bronze and Brighten Cheek Palette. So I'm going to open it up. This brings a mirror, a very nice size mirror, and it says Pure. Sorry about the mess. It says Pure right there on the mirror. And then you have your shades. And these are the shades right here. So you have the bronzer right here, the highlight, and the blush. So that's it right there. This is the Glam Metals. This is by Crown Brush. It says, Rock your look with Crown Pro Glam Metals Eyeshadow Palette. These highly pigmented, ultra blendable shadows make smoky eyes look a breeze. To take your look up a notch, wet your shadow brush before application. This will intensify the foiling effect of the shadow, resulting in a sultry, smoky glam that will make you want to rock the night away. And I already swatched these, not wet, dry. It has a mirror that's shaped like a pretty guitar. Oh, my daughter saw this though. My daughter loved this because, you know, she's a fanatic with her guitars. And here are the shades. All right. And the last thing in the box is this Pores No More Luminizer Primer by Dr. Brandt. All skin types, illuminating primer, base. It says, apply to clean, moisturized skin. Use alone for a natural bounce of light on the skin and under your makeup to prep your skin for a flawless application, AM and PM. So you get one full ounce in this. And now I'll tell you the prices of everything. The luminizer, the pore luminizer by Dr. Brandt is $38. 
The It Cosmetics Brow Power is $24. The Crown Pro Metals Palette is $25. The Pure, the Complexion Authority Bronze, Brighten, <laughs> Bronze and Brighten Cheek Palette is $34. And the Girl Lactic Matte Lip Paint is $23. So the total value of this box this month is $144. Damn. Derm, derm, derm. So now, let's go ahead and jump into this, guys. I'm going to do my makeup. Try at least with all these products. Minus, of course, that I need to, you know, get my foundation on. So I'm going to go ahead and prime my face. And I'm using the Dr. Brands. All right, guys, so while that settles into the skin, I mean, it doesn't look bad. And my face looks a little bit luminized, but not, like, super crazy. And I'll leave her channel link down below. I think it's um, Foundation Fairy. She got this first, and we kind of have kind of like the same, um, you know, issue with our skin, that combo oily, you know, dry kind of, you know, issue. And she, I asked her about it, and she said that, um, yeah, it wasn't bad. And it did what it was supposed to do. It luminized, but it wasn't, it didn't bring out any of her oils. And her pores didn't look, like, accentuated. So, we'll see. Because I might have bigger pores than hers. We never know. I'm going to do my eyes first, actually. This is one of my Walgreens brushes. And I'm going to go into that middle shade right there. Which is the um, bronzer shade. And that's going to be my transition color and it's going up in my crease i'm gonna go ahead and go into the metals palette okay, i'm gonna start with uh the wicked which is that shade right there go in with the bmx 430 crease brush this is by royal and lang nickel we got this in our boxy charm also so i'm gonna go ahead and start with that shade right there okay so now that i have that on there and i have it blended out it doesn't look like a shimmer at all I mean, it looks very like a soft satin matte. It just looks pretty. I really like it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my BH Cosmetics Black Gel Liner and I'm going to put this all over my lid. Okay, so now once that's on there, before it dries, I'm going to go ahead and grab another uh, basically flat brush. And I'm going to go into the black shade, which is Black Metal. And I'm going to start packing that on. Kind of like to set this. Once that's on there, I'm going to start just buffing that right on the edge. And try, you know, trying to get it as soft as I can. Now I'm going to go back into that brush and back into Wicked, that maroon shade. And we're going to start right at the crease and putting that in. Okay, so once I have that diffused... There we go. We're going to do the other eye off camera. Same thing. I'll be right back. Now, once that's done, I'm going to go ahead into my eyebrows real quick before I continue. And I'm going to use uh, the brow pencil. Here's the deal. I think this is good for people that have um, brows. But because I have to draw in so much of my brows, I'm missing so much of my hair. Um, yeah, it's just not happening for me. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to try the Bella Pierre Brow. What is it again? I keep forgetting. Stay Put Brow Gel. Oh, wow. Look at that. Now look at this one. It's Brow Universal. And Bella Pierre. It's Bella Pierre. All right, guys. So one eye is basically complete. I'm going to do this side. I'm going to show you what, guys what I did. So I went in with just a flat shader brush and I took, I'm using my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Matte Finishing Spray and I'm wetting that brush and I'm starting off at, with this shade right here, which is Wild Thang. And when I was doing the other eye, I went in with it dry at first and true to their word, it's best if you go in with this uh, wet. Look at that. You see that color? That is Rebel. And Rebel is going right 
on top, almost on top of that one towards the middle. I'm grabbing this Real Techniques. This is just a detailer brush. And I'm going to go in with a Punk right here. This is the Hard Candy Glitter Glue. And now I'm going to go in with Pop Rock down here. Oh, I'm sorry, with Heavy Metal. And I'm going to mix it with Punk. And I'm going back into that inner corner. Now I'm just taking a liner brush and I'm going in with my um, BH Studio Pro liner in black. Is it black? What is it called again? I always get the name wrong. Onyx. And I'm just going to line my eye. I'm not doing a wing. All right, guys, so my face is powdered up and ready for these shadows. I went in with uh, my Sonia Kasha pointed pencil brush and I added that bronzing shade right underneath and I added some of my BH uh, liner. So now I'm gonna go ahead and go in, I'm gonna take the black and I'm gonna press it against that liner and just start smudging it in a little. Now I'm gonna go back into that pointed brush and clean it off on my color switch and I'm gonna start going in with this color which is the color that I put on my crease. Now I'm gonna go ahead and grab Glam Rock right here. I really like this shade, and I'm gonna just go ahead and place that there and blend that in with all of these. I mean, look how beautiful those are. I'm digging this palette. I'm grab just Heavy Metal and Punk. And these are going right in my inner bottom corner right there. I'm gonna go ahead and grab, this is my Real Techniques uh, sculpting brush. And I'm gonna not go into the bronzer, but I'm gonna go into the contour shade, this shade. And I like this brush because it fits perfectly, right? Oh, oh, I didn't expect that. Oh. Wow. Okay, that was salvageable. Wow, that was scurry. Grab my other brush, and we are going to bronze up this puppy. I'm gonna go into my Pure palette. I'm gonna grab my BH Cosmetics. This is the number two pro brush. And I'm gonna go into that bronzer let's see what it does i mean it looks like a beautiful shade like for the summer which i'm all down for wearing it now okay let's see oh yes listen it's not something that i would wear every day but absolutely look at that Bring it down, all the way down. Oh my God, that looks so pretty. I don't know if you guys can really see how beautiful that looks. Like, that in person looks stunning. And I'm not putting a lot. Oh, yes. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my Morphe. This is my angled brush. And these don't have names because these are my vegan ones. And I'm gonna go ahead and go into that peach shade. Now, I know that these are super pigmented from when I did my swatch, so let me just take it easy. I put so many matte products on that when I put all this glimmer on and then I put my matte setting sprays, you'll see. So now I'm gonna go in with the highlight. So let me grab my highlighting brush. And I'm using my Morphe M510 brush. Oh my God, this is stunning. Absolutely stunning. Using my Wet n Wild Matte Finishing Setting Spray. I'm gonna go in with the NYX Lingerie first. And I'm gonna go in with Posh. This is from Galactic. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab my palette. I'm gonna grab a little of Rebel, that copper shade right there. So that's it. I'm done. This is the finished look. So what do you guys think? 
I think that these two boxes together made an amazing uh, month, made me happy receiving my boxes because I've been a little bit um, on the fence about them. I've been thinking about getting rid of them and I don't know, maybe finding new subscription boxes because they just haven't been my cup of tea lately. I was ecstatic to see Girl Actic. I love Girl Actic. I like um, NYX. I love uh, Crown brushes. I have a bunch of their brushes and I love them. They're so pigmented, but look how pretty. And Pure just finished everything off. Like that bronzer and peach blush and highlight. It just finished the look. This was up. nice. I like the feeling that it left on my face. Um, oh my God, wait, wait. And I'll let you guys know when I wash my face how this worked out. I'll leave it down in the description bar because I'm going to use it. But this, this left my face feeling so like smooth and and uh, not silky, just like satin smooth. And the only thing that I didn't like from this box, guys, actually was this. I didn't like it. This is not a shade for everyone. And no, you can't make it any darker. I mean, how much product am I supposed to put the whole thing? I like these. I could carry these with me. Take them with me. I'm out of here. Because look, and this. Because look, it fits and, and I'm out. And I'm leaving. And I got to go. All right, guys. Let me know what you think. You have a comment section. You know what to do. You know how to do. And you know when to do it. I love you guys.